many might say it's the fair food that makes the state fair. There are all the fun rides, of course. And lots of cool animals to see and pet. But all that yummy food. Yeah, man. That smells amazing and it looks amazing too. Bob and Stephanie Llewellyn of Benicia made sure to make it out for the last day of the fair. Gonna eat, hang out, thinking about maybe hanging out for the concert later on to watch Trace Adkins. How was the kebab? Great. Thumbs up. <laughs> Thumbs up. So Howard, my photographer, loves the kebabs, but the tri-tip is to die for. But the corn on the cob, I get this every year. For Micah and his four-year-old daughter. My first time in the fair in years. She's got a ride in, now she's full eating corn dogs, so she's good. She's good, a full day for her. Tiring for me, riding around in this one right here. But they weren't done just yet. She's had uh, two corn dogs and then she's gonna have some of this too, so she's got a full meal today. <laughs> and you're gonna dabble a little in that Yeah, just a little bit. I think I deserve it, pushing her around all day. I, de I deserve it. The last day, so I'm enjoying it with my coconut. <laughs> They have fresh coconut, and I'm gonna go get it right now to get cut and get flesh, the meat. I feel like I'm on an exotic island, it's so cool. <laughs> and being the last day of the fair, Leslie ages didn't waste any time. So far. I had the cheese curd, the pork chop on a stick, fried pork chop with applesauce, and then onion rings, and um, that's it for now. But I'm coming back for the corn dog. <laughs> Leslie and the hubs, Andrew, along with her good friends Kaylee and Brian Haas, just wanted to enjoy each other's company while experiencing everything the fair had to offer. You know, it's like a double date, and we're just having fun enjoying the food. Come out, have a good time. Spend, make some memories with your family. And friends, come out and have a good time with us. Drink plenty of water. Uh, in, be in between. <laughs> At the State Fair, covering local news that matters, Rowena Shaddix, Fox, 40 News.